All right, to get warmed up, I thought we would take a look at some objects that start with the letter C that make that k sound of C, like a k k candy cane, or a k k crown, like a king might wear a k k crown. Oh, okay. Now, I said we don't see these very often. This is a k k camera that, remember, says k k click, a camera that you take pictures with. Oh, this is a very delicious C word. I don't know if you can see it. It's a cake, a cake. It says happy birthday. It's a cake. How about a k k camel? Camel starts with C. A k k car and oh, you, what you would put on that cake? It's a k k candle that you might put on that birthday cake. So let's go ahead and review the sound for C. Remember that when you do the clicking of the camera, it makes that k sound. So let's do it together. Ready? And let's review that sound for B. B, 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 B. Like when the ball is bouncing. Now I have some words for you. And you need to have your B flashcard and your C flashcard because you're going to hold up the flashcard that begins that word. So if I say cake, that C flashcard will come right up, right? Or if I say bit, the B flashcard. So here we go. Bad. Definitely letter B. Call. Bell. Cost. Burn. Bang. Cup. Bus. Here you go. All right. I wanted to take a minute and try and blend a few words that have these sounds in them. So let's start with the first one. I'm going to write C A B up here on the board. C A B. Now the C says k, the A says a, and the B says b. Put them together. K, ab. Cab. All right, let's try another one. Let's try C A T. And that may be familiar to some of you. You may just know it just by looking at it. C says K, A says A, and T says T. Put them together. K, at. Cat. Let's try one more. Let's do B A. T. The B says B. The A says A. Ah. And the T says T. Put them together. B. At. That. All right. For your work today, you will be doing pages 94 and 95 in your um, workbook. And you will be making uppercase B and lowercase B. So let's just review that really quick before you get started on how to make those letters. We always start the capital at or near the top, right? So we're starting at the top, we're going to pull down to the bottom. And then the B has a bump to the middle and a bump to the bottom for capital B, okay? Lowercase B is a tall letter too, so it starts on the top, pulls down to the bottom, and you only make a bump at the bottom for lowercase b. So pages 94 and 95 in your reading workbook, and when you're all finished, upload your work to Schoology.